Hello everybody and welcome to BattleBots Reborn! Today's cute cat video is not of Teal, it's of my brother's cat Nala, watching Robot Chicken. Swirly! So first up today is Swirly, and there is a build video of Swirly on Patreon, so make sure you go check that out, link in the description. Now, Swirly caused me a little bit of problems. This body's actually a little bit small, but that is the biggest disc that was possible to us. I was hoping it would actually stick out like it does on the real Swirly, but instead I had to make an ex uh, a little thing with extenders and angle connectors to try and resemble a disc sticking out of the middle of the body. It came out okay, and I actually thought of a way to improve it once I was already done filming the bot. So maybe I'll do that in the future. Might slow down the blade a little, little bit, whatever. Uh, axe heads for the teeth, pretty good, but this bot does have one huge problem. So you see the nub there of the HPZ tech motor, because um, it's attached to the body, it doesn't appear. But when Swirly gets flipped, it is there, and it is solid, and those top wheels do not touch. So technically he is not an invertible bot, and that, yes, does cause a huge problem for this build. I haven't thought of the best way to correct it besides maybe a normal angle connector motor there, but then the weapon sucks, or I figure out how to make my own piece, which I don't know how to do. So if any of you know how to make a custom piece, let me know. What do you got, Snowjob? What do you got? No, 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 please! Okay, it's not embarrassing because he's built for the Serena. GET THE FUCK OUT OF HERE! Oh, no, 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 no! Come on! And now you see what I mean. The Z-Tech causing problems! And so is Snowjob, son of a bitch. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out! Watch out, 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 Of course, because I won. This is more rigged than boxing. Well, I'm tired of this room and everyone in it. No emergency. Wait, stop, I have a family. Don't do this, don't do this! Leave me alone, no! Hey, what the fuck, no, this is supposed to be for the opponents, not me! Turn this shit off! Haha, <laughs> I gotcha! Now come on, we're going to the bathroom, I'm gonna give you a swirly. <laughs> Jesus Christ. If I had a nickel for every time Ronan got stuck like this, I would make more money than what YouTube pays creators per view. <laughs> That's for being an asshole in the first two fights. Time for my special move. The Rex Rocket! Oh my God! So it's time to grade Swirly, and he actually wasn't too bad. In appearance, um, it could have been a little bit better, you know, if we had the disc, actually a disc sticking out instead of extenders, that would have been helpful, and, you know, some stickers. Weapon, I think, was a little too good in the game compared to real life. Record accuracy, he had more wins than losses, but the ratio wasn't the same, so I feel like a C is probably good enough for that. And then gameplay, he wasn't a bad bot, he caused a lot of damage, just would have been a little bit better if he was, you know, invertible. World Peace! Next up is World Peace. Now, the build is missing a lot of custom skins, so it's not going to look that good, and I did my best to start off with, I tried to look up a lot of the different companies, but nothing came up, nothing correct. The weaponry was a bit of a pain in the ass. What I did is, inside there is one of those high-powered, thin-body uh, servo motors to get the whole thing moving with a weight ballast on the other side, and then there was a low-powered servo motor to get the top part of the beak going. It looks good, it moves correctly, but it's just not gonna be good, is it? Like, just think of this combination, and just look at it. There's no fucking way. There's no way it's gonna be good. And he's a little bit small, this bot, but whatever. He's gonna suck anyway, we know that. He's supposed to suck. Snowjob is so stupid. What is he doing? Whoa, wait, the weapon works? Alright, there it is. He can go unbeaten. I'm calling it now. Why do you say those things? Hey, I can dream, can I? Ooh, wait a minute. I got a bite here. If we play this right, we can do this. 
Hell yeah! That's smoother than getting struck down by a smooth criminal. Oh, we got him perfectly. Move, Hanky Panky! What are you doing? Bitch! Alright, we could probably take out Bear first. Oh my god, what am I actually doing? This is probably getting fucked in ass! Okay, just because Cole says something doesn't mean it's true. Easy. Dad beats so crappy you think he'd be one of those new King of Bots contenders. Alright, time to take out these two pieces of shit. Alright, which one of you is gonna take this dick first? Did I fucking ask you? Get back here. Alright, how about you, big dog? Take this dick. Hell, we ain't gonna take it. What the hell are you guys doing? This is probably the minority's fault. If the president's taught me anything, is that you can blame anything on the minorities. Only RA2 can make me pissed when I'm doing well. I hope I'm getting attacked! Permission to do something about it! Next time, don't fucking mess with me! Oh, look what you made me do. Look what you made me do. So it's time to grade World Peace. And, yep, as you can see, he pretty much sucked everywhere. Appearance, I would have gone with an A because the body shape and the weapon seemed okay, but he needed the custom skins to look a lot closer. The weapon, I saw the fight against Dissector from Season 2, looked like he did okay, couldn't find anything else, but that was enough to give me the benefit of the doubt that yes, his weapon can do something in real life, whereas ours was pretty crappy. Record, he was a losing bot overall in his career, and he was a winning record here, so that's that. And then gameplay, so fucking frustrating when you have such a terrible weapon. Yeah, I'm glad we're done with World Peace. Hey, you! Do you have a favorite BattleBot that you would like to be part of this series? Leave a comment of the BattleBot's name below. Also, if you got more spare time on your hands, check out our Patreon. Link in the description. A lot of other cool content. Yeah! That's it, you son of a bitch! Born out of frustration, but two feet in the air. Absolutely right. Straight red card. Basic victory. That was more of a cruise than a Florida Georgia Line song. Oh, don't you start this with me!